Oof, a ring of stinger for game number eight against the Broston Celtics. Um, so, down TV against Woodells because he's actually he's got a um, journeyman. It's good that he's only got one catcher or no catchers for this game then. Both catchers missing this game is nice, isn't it? He's got a tree man that can get hit by claw. Block guard tree man. What's his record here? 955. Five. He's got his plus strength war dancer. With strip. So I guess I'm really regretting not having... Not taking sure hands now. Or block. Playing against war dancers. I mean, what's the chance of playing against war dancers? Pretty fucking low. One, two, three. Only three blodge. Accurate on his thrower. So, you know. I don't know. I don't really want to get a wizard here. I guess I get a bribe and just foul, foul the shit out of him. I could get the wizard for when he steals it to steal it back. Hmm... Maybe go for the wizard for the counter, the count, the steal, the steal back. The fucking strength for ward answer. Fuck off. Maybe go for the wizard for the counter steal. But on the other hand, he is nine five five with a plus strength ward answer. So maybe he's terrible at blood ball. Having to spend all 70k kind of sucks. But if he steals it, I'm never going to knock down his war dancer. So, yeah, okay. There's no way. <laughs> Got no tackle. So, yeah, wizard, fuck it. Yeah, Mog does have a six foot arm blade, yeah. Mm, yeah, I probably will suit on him, to be fair. I probably would foul his strength for ward answer if he hits the ground. Probably would. This is one of those games where um, Inarian's strategy would probably pay off for him, wouldn't it? Because he's, it's so easy for him to turn me over with a strength for ward answer. With strip ball. No sure hands, no ducky. Went with movement. Went with movement. I mean, I would never have gone sure hands first skill anyway. I don't know, maybe he's gone block first skill. Um, but I would never, I would never have gone sure hands first skill. To be fair. Mm, he's receiving. Uh oh Does he know who I am? He said hi, Jimmy. Normally a bad sign. <laughs> Have mercy on my health. There's no mercy. Do you know what? I might try to stop him scoring here because I've got the wizard, haven't I? Okay, let's try to stop him scoring. I don't know though because it means everyone gets tied up on the tree whereas I could, have, I could do a wider setup where they don't he's probably not going to go the side of the claw so then it, then it goes more block well not the claw it's only a mighty blow isn't it not go the side of the beast sorry so yeah, having more block this side and the mighty blow this side's okay.
Maybe he'll go down this side now because there's a little no block. But then if he does, he goes into the beast. He's probably going to avoid the beast, isn't he? Ugh. I don't know. Tell him to piss himself, then we might know. <laughs> that's a uh, that's karate kid, isn't it? Um, BLGF. <laughs> Tell your opponent you fucked his mum. Holy shit. <laughs> what is this question? I don't know. <laughs> Let me win, yeah. <laughs> Come on, the shit root of one in this one. I didn't see any questions, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If you say at Jimmy Fantastic, I'm better at it. Better than that. <laughs> you marry me. Um, sorry, no, Aguirre Weeks. I can't do that. Ladder is all about collusion, yeah. Oh, man. He's gone for the block guy. What a bastard. What a bastard. He's gone for the block guy. Well, I even figured he'd go that side, and I still put the block guy there to get hit by the tree. That was pretty dumb, wasn't it? I guess though, at least he, at least he might, he's protected by a block. But fuck, he's probably just gonna get banged on. Where's the movement for, guys? He on the pitch? No. Do you have a one or two ball? I like the two balls start. Um, I like the two balls apple six six dwarf start. Full full positionals, two re rolls start. And and Apple. Oh well, actually, I like the twelve man start as well. Oh yeah, there you go, bleeding hippie on point VIP bleeding hippie. I don't know Mortlock ten. He is nine five five, but he does have a strength four war dancer now. Whether he was whether how depends how recently he's got this war dancer. If he'd got this like it's second skill, isn't it? No third skill. He's taken. If he's if he's just got the strength ward answer, then it explains why he's nine five five. However, if he had got strength as his first skill, he would have um maybe he maybe he would have gone nineteen and all. <laughs> Natalie Dragon, bang on some fools, Natalie Dragon. Yeah, Sage's three minute video. Oh man. Pushed. I do like rotters. Every time they don't die, it's like, get in. Get in, they didn't die when they were punched. He didn't die. It's brilliant, isn't it? It's fucking brilliant when people don't die. Holy shit. It's a rarity. But when it happens, when people don't actually die, it's pretty good. I'm a dickhead. I did 20%. No, I didn't take. Shit, man.
Oh, area complete. Get banged on time. Time to switch to the DPS formation. And the auto clicking. Because <laughs> I'll be damned if I'm going to click in a clicking game. He's an absolute madman. Look at him making dodges on two pluses and everything. I never pass these two plus rolls. That's why I don't why I don't use elves. Safe moves first. Tag the Canoring threat. Could have made this three dice maybe, but of course I just need the push. Oh my god, got him. I'm going straight in for the foul here. I don't give a shit. I've got a dirty player and I'm not afraid to use him. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Get banged on. Beautiful. Beast moves around. Sexy thing. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, God. A GFI would be really cool, wouldn't it? It's stopping breaking through. Oh. Fuck it, I'll go for it. Oh, my God, I'm so good at rolling dice. Does he want to dodge away or him? Do you want to get smashed by three dice? Might go. I guess this makes it harder to three dice him, so I'll stand him up. Someone's getting banged on. <laughs> yeah, that was a that was a fucking greed reroll there, wasn't it? That was a. That was an enjoyable foul. That was an enjoyable foul. Yeah. An actual successful foul. He's only got 11 players too, so even any player down would have been good. But obviously, especially A Ward answer. This fuckhead's got to go next. It was only a rookie Ward answer, unfortunately. But still, it's hard for him to break through this defence, which is good. I'd rather he didn't break through.
couple more DP. Yeah, only the third best player on his team. Yeah, I guess it was, wasn't it? Yeah, but I mean, this guy's the team, isn't it? This guy's the whole team. Everything else is basically irrelevant. Well, the, the tree's kind of cool. Got the cheeky lineman hiding behind him, so you forget. Um, but really, this guy's the team. Even though he's a war dancer, like it's it's obviously good to get rid of war dancer. But even though he's a war dancer, he's just nothing compared to this fuckhead, is he? It's because he got it out first to Goya Weeks. That's it. That's the, that's purely all it is. He got it out first. <laughs> Love that sage intro. Yeah, that's true. That's true. VIP done again. Yeah, finally get a claw. <laughs> Boom. At least three k. Oh yeah, of course it is. Of course it is. It's a great start. It is absolutely a great start. I, I never implied that it wasn't. I was just sad that it wasn't the other one. You know, like if it had been that one, I, th I would have been confident of winning. But um, against this guy, what do you even do? Like, this guy could one-dice the ball, get it down 50% of the time. He gets the ball down fucking 35 times out of fucking 36, doesn't he? The motherfucker. He's just unbeatable. He's outrageous. So, I would have much rather cast him on turn one. But yeah, of course. Like, and the tree, I don't really care about casting. So, he was the, he was basically a yeah, second or third best player. Oh, he double one. <gasps> he's got sidestep, but I don't, oh, he hasn't double one. Fuck, he hasn't got touch. But he's used a reroll, which is good. I could have maybe served him because I had that many players. I still might be able to surf him if he doesn't, if he doesn't do anything. Run out of time. God, I might be able to surf him. I might be able to surf him here. <laughs> Beast goes in there. He goes in there. He goes in there. He goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, GFI. And then he goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, GFI. Well, I've got to try, haven't I? Fucking cunting cunt of a fucking shithead fucking cunt cunt fucking cunt 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 fucking beast That's why I don't like the beast. Oh yeah beasts are good against elves fuck off fucking beasts Jesus fucking Christ Ah. I can do it, but how do I fucking do it now? Dodge on a fucking Nogal Warrior. Dodge on this guy. Fuck off, you Dodge on this guy and one dice blitz. Jesus fucking Christ. Fucking shithead. Stupid fucking cunt beast. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm going to delete it after this game, I think. So, I guess I'll make the Nurgle Warrior dodge. We'll attempt the Nurgle Warrior dodge. Oh no, I could go for his, the, that block guy. Alright, okay. 
Double GFI. Let's go. Right, I've got no recovery now. Got no recovery now, thanks beast. Classic overcommit. <sighs> this is all I can do, isn't it? And no rerolls for it either. I don't think I use a reroll on this. Well, I can go there. Alright, maybe I can use a reroll. Alright, I'll go for the Nug Warrior dodge. Oh, shit. Are you Raj Shawnee? Are you, are you stupid? See, this skill here, Shawnee, is sidestep. <laughs> so that's why I did all this. I wasn't just a fucking lunatic. <laughs> I wasn't a complete fucking lunatic. It was surfing a sidestepper. <laughs> fucking shit hair, Shawnee. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he still scores, but at least he ain't gonna fucking stall it out, is he? <laughs> I'm not just the worst player in Blood Bowl, <laughs> randomly doing all of this, thinking that these mattered at all when it did, didn't matter. <laughs> yeah, I guess, I guess I'm a fucking lunatic, yeah. Sean, <laughs> he was thinking with his hair. Oh, man. Do you think Ed the Mad? I don't know. I liked I liked going for that dodge. These two haven't even acted yet. He could have still done exactly what he's done. This was the worst. This was the worst. This fucking beast failing. If this beast hasn't failed, I wouldn't have activated him. But I needed people to come back. It was too easy to come back. It was too easy to just walk two dice him and get everyone through. I think you're absolutely wrong. I don't think the extra player that would have made made an action matters at all. So I think you're wrong there. Unequivocally, Ed the Band. Once again, my opponent's about to score, so you chirp up with something completely unhelpful. Yeah, exactly. The warrior was easily cleared, yeah. Yeah. He could have done that anyway. He could have done that anyway. However, if he makes the dodge and the two GFIs, it's not easy. So... There you go. Right decision from Jimmy. Wrong one from Ed the Mad. Um, never mind. Oh, I'm still muted. But there you go, anyway. What I was saying is I was muted was... I've just banned you forever now, Ed the Mad. Because it's easier. Yeah.
Yeah. Not even not even a ten minute timeout, just banned forever. Because <laughs> it's so angry to just try his vocal cords. <laughs> Holy shit, right. He's gonna bang on the tree man, isn't he? I don't even care. I don't even care how stupid it is. Has he got a player behind the tree? No, he doesn't. Get that ass banned. I mean, I just don't even know what I do here now, really. I just get fucked on by this by this fucking blitzer. <laughs> no, he didn't. Uh, he didn't say. It. Maybe it was better. It was like you're just wrong. That's what he just winds me up. He winds me up because he can't just say like maybe that was a better move. Like you know, in a move that nearly cost me the game, not not dodging a warrior. Somebody said maybe you should move that. Maybe you should have dodged that warrior. For, tried dodging that warrior first, and I was like, yeah, that's uh, that's actually. That's actually a good idea. Maybe I should have done that. But Ed the Maz just like, you're wrong to have done that. And that was just wrong. That was bad. That was wrong. And it just does my nothing. I really needed a power on one of these, didn't I? I guess I follow and then um, make use the blitz on him anyway. Oh shit. No, I couldn't have blitz with the mighty blow guy. Yeah, I think that was you, Mana Rage. Yeah, you know, it's it's just like. There's just a fucking way of doing things, isn't there? And just like. Basically calling me shit is not the way to make a valid point, I don't think. Saying that I'm shit and wrong. Is not really gonna. Um, it's not really helping, is it? It's not constructive. He's just never constructive. Never constructive is all Ed the Mad. Right. He can't reach. So even if I fail the pickup, it's not bad. So I'm not. I'm not gonna reroll the fail pickup. Well, I've got to pick it up eventually, though, don't I? Fuck it. I'll reroll the fail pickup. Oh, I made it. Get banged on. Why is this guy over here? Oh, did I m fucking misclick? Oh, God. Alright, that's okay then. Beast. Come on, beastie poo. Oh, yeah. And now, because I fucking moved him by accident, I can't get the foul in. Well, I could foul him with no assist. Doesn't seem good, though, does it? Protect him a little bit, or... Push is no good at the moment. Push is good over there. So maybe go over there. <laughs> 20 pound equals all's forgiven. <laughs> um. <laughs> you should have fucked this mum first. <laughs> Falling for tree magnetism. Yeah, it's really good against bad players, isn't it, the tree? Fucking Jim Con, Jimmy, Kim Jong Il, Jimmy Sullivan, the supreme bastard. There you go. Um. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, picked up in the rain, unbelievable. Yeah, exactly the Savar Saravak. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, think how you phrase things. That's all. That's all. And he just he can't do it. And maybe it's a language barrier. You know, I don't know what I don't know what is what his first language is at the mad. But he just does my nut in every time. The fucking lights move from the front here, so unfortunately the lights are gonna be a bit shit. Twenty quid a chicken foul on a chiggy hand job. Oh yeah. Nah, I can't foul the tree without a dirty player. Did he use a reroll on the stand up? Or was it um? Oh, is it rooted? It's rooted. All right, good. 
Good. Rooted means I can try and dodge away from it. Johnny Foreigners, but yeah. <laughs> Uptown Funktastic. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, VIP, don't look at this. Yeah, yeah that's it. <laughs> yeah, that maybe, maybe, Grindel, maybe. I don't know how it works, though. I, I don't think they're all... I don't think they all have Portuguese. Portuguese is the first language to do it. I want to hit him again, even though he's rooted, but just because it's fun, isn't it? It's just fun. Right, how, how far can he get? <laughs> so the ball can go here this turn. Do I bring some guys back to cage it? Do I run up into cage into, into blitzable range to just to cage it or not? That is the question. <sighs> Bit choppy. It's the rain, isn't it? Could put him in and 2D him down, but then it's good in being rooted, isn't it? But he's in the middle, but I can go one side or the other. I've got to go this side if I go aside. Fuck it, I'll go aside. Fuck it, you only live twice, don't you? Right. Fuck it. Get banged on. Blitz with him to get a mighty blow hit. Mighty blow hit, a block hit even. And activate the beast. Potentially. Mighty blow hit instead of block it. Oh, did you? What a shit cunt. Oh no. Oh, Play well, that's what you get. Yeah, yeah, to be fair, yeah, Sludge Funkton, look, it's just that it's it's consistently done it. I've I've timed him out so many times, he always rubs me up the wrong way, always. Like, he's done it so many times, he's called Ed the Band, you know? So, like, to consistently keep doing it, I, I don't know, it's just easier for me to not put up with it. Maybe I should have just moved him in there and two dice the tree, but I like the fact that he's rooted. <laughs> yeah. The thing is, he's rooted though. That's the thing, Hippie, right? Normally I would have punched him. Normally I would have done that. But he's rooted. That's why. That's why. That, to everybody, that's why. It's because. Should have been by the 15 out of 216 KO chance. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, against against Woody's is not the time where you want to get big guys knocked out and stunned, is it? But I mean, he's lost two already, so it is nine versus ten at the moment. Ten versus nine at the moment. But yeah, that that's the reason that I was dodging was um... oh, Mikey thirty-five. 
Yeah, that that was the reason. That was the reason that I did the dodge because he's rooted. If he wasn't rooted, I would have totally hit him. But um, you know, if I block him, he stands up on turn five potentially, and then he's got three turns of affecting the game instead of dodging away, and he's got no turns of affecting the game. Well, some streaming. I mean, it's not it's not affecting my game whatsoever, but I imagine that's why it's affecting the streaming with the raining. It's absolutely fine on my PC, but yeah, it's the streaming, isn't it? It's the thing. I'd rather I'd rather just moved and and you know done something. I've got to try and score, haven't I? It's not easy. It's not easy to try and try to get forward enough to score. Especially when you get a guy fucking stunned like that. He is, but I'd still rather him be rooted than not. <sighs> Alright. That ball's made, though. I'm not up ball region. Fucking me. He just removed two players by getting rooted. Jesus fucking Christ, man. Yeah, he's completely funneling me down this side. What a fucking turn. What a godly fucking turn that was for him. No, he's only affecting these squares, isn't he? He's only affecting nine squares. It's not bad. It's not as bad as if he wasn't rooted and he's, he's affecting all of these squares that he can GFI to get. But yeah, obviously now I'm looking... Now it's looking like I could have just fucking two-diced him, doesn't it? Now Ed the Mad can turn up and say, should have two-diced him, then your whole team wouldn't have fucking died. Yeah, cheers, buddy. Maybe I should stand in front of the tree. <sighs> I should stand here. And then go where he's weakest on turn six. He could blitz somebody into the tree though. So I'd have to maybe go back to here. That was a good roll. See what he does next turn. Yeah, I could. Oh shit! Yeah, I could fight. I could always break through with a fireball. Yeah. Man. Fucking tree removing two players because he fucking rooted. That's outrageous. Yeah, I guess I do have the wizard. Yeah, that's something to remember. Definitely. Yeah, I had claw, that's what I blocked him. I blocked him and then I, but I dodged away with him rather than hitting him again. Not realising that he'd get killed and he'd get, well, 
kind of KO'd. Yeah, so I can go whichever way he's less protected next turn, can't I? Just got to get over the over the halfway line on turn six. Yeah, obviously that the fireball is going to be on turn seven, or bolt. Fucking hell, man! <laughs> it would be good if it would be good if if he if I had had eleven on the pitch and he had nine, kind of eight, but unfortunately, that guy being stunned was pretty bad. If he could have just stood up, then I would have just blitzed with a Nurgle Warrior and, um, you know, had some basings going on. It's 5 2 0 overall, Master Fall. Maybe, maybe 5 2 0 after this game, you never know. It could be possible to not lose. The win's going to be hard, though, isn't it? Very hard. Need the fucking weather to change as well. I can't believe the weather. The weather happened after after he scored. That's horrible, isn't it? Captain Hindsight. He's a dirty dingo. I'm so gutted, by the way. Fucking, there's a new, a new update out for GTA Online. Oh, he's let us go this way, hasn't he? That's good. When I say let us, it's obviously not ideal because there's a fucking strength four war dancer ready to get in the way. Read it. Oh yeah. Good greed. Greed is good. Yeah, there is a strength four war dance in the way, greed but works. You can go there. It's pretty shit that he wants to make a GFI without a reroll. Oh man. Oh man. This fucking cage. I guess I can't make a GFI. He can make one though. Fuck it. Over the halfway line. It's about the best I can do. Yeah, there's been a new update for GTA Online, and I th there's there's a there was a fucking it said they were gonna have a classic Lamborghini, so I was hoping for a Contage, but it was a Diablo. And I'm very sad. VGP is Captain Hindsight. <laughs> he is, yeah, he always comments on the replay. Which, to be fair, commenting on the replay is much better than waiting for people to take fucking four minute turns. Yeah, fake sports broadcast, absolutely. Hello, VIPs will do, by the way. <laughs> He's a WWE announcer, kind of. No, oh, yeah, they do, yeah, Beezy, oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> um, great GT story. I don't have a real Lamborghini, no. 
<laughs> I've always wanted a Contage in real life. It's the only car I've ever wanted, but um, neglected to try to make enough money to get one. <laughs> He's still got three re-rolls, so I'm fucked here, aren't I? Oh yeah, it's pretty old, isn't it? The the Lamborghinis look like fucking spaceships nowadays, don't they? <laughs> in GTA, I do, yeah, Guayawix. In GTA, I've got a Lamborghini and I live in the Hollywood Hills. But, um, in real life, I'd like one. <laughs> I'd like one. They're pretty expensive, though. The fucking Contashes are, like, more expensive than, um, like, better ones. I don't know what they're called. Aventador. An Aventador is cheaper than a Contash. Oh, he's making the Shawnees now. Nah, you can just make some two pluses to stop me, can't he? That's, that's the unfortunate thing. I say unfortunate. It's not really unfortunate, is it? It's just bad. <laughs> it's just shit. Look at that needless, needless dodge just to be a dirty dingo. He, he made all the. Oh man, he made all the rolls that turn. Fuck. Imagine if he'd failed one of them and I could just blitz him through and, like, just caged around here. Canoring threat. First action. I, I could obviously fireball a bolt or something, but I've got to go forward three squares. Oh god. I can't even do it. <sighs> well, at least he can't score. So I should go balls, balls out now. I should absolutely go balls out because he can't score. Bolt the dancer. If I bolt him now though, then I'm not bolting him next turn. The thing is, it's how can he not push me? How can he just not push me? It's not even possible for him to not push me. So I have to get four forward, which is just suicide. So maybe I should have go here. Maybe that was the play. Maybe that was the play to actually just blitz there and um, and just make two GFIs over here. Maybe that was the play. Oh, and that's only for two squares. So maybe I should have blitzed the tree. Maybe chain myself forward with this guy or something next turn. Now, but he can't not push me, that's the thing. I need to make three squares this turn. So he he got his he got his fucking shitty little elf screen in exactly the right amount of space. I just have to do this. There's no there's no other play to make than that. Maybe I could foul him. Seeing as I've got the reserves.
Oh, it's not going to be tough to get two scores. It's going to be impossible. <laughs> it's absolutely impossible. But at least it's only 1-0 at half-time. That's not that bad. 1-0 down at half-time isn't the end of the world. Hopefully the weather changes. And... Um, and... You know... Managed to score <laughs> double pal. Yeah, we're so dumb just having to run forward like that. But well, at least he's not scoring. Oh man, if he'd caught it, that would have been ace. <laughs> yeah, I guess if I kill that warden, there's a chance. Yeah, true. True, that's fair. Now, he hasn't got much with his. Nah, but still, even then, I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want to risk it against fucking owls, to be honest. <laughs> yep, that's why I, that's why I put him there. It's still possible, but he's gonna he's gonna make that very difficult, isn't he? Well, difficult or easier, one of the two, or no different, or something. It was just that last turn when he made all the two pluses. And it wasn't hard. Obviously, it wasn't hard to make these two pluses. Oh, this fucking green screen's fucked and there's no light in front. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I wonder what Ed the Mad. That's, that's, the, that's, the, that's the question, isn't it? What would Ed the Mad do? Right. What is the answer here? I could blitz him, get him there, and then it's a 4-3 plus out, or he could just blitz himself out. Blitzing himself out on one dice, I think, is best, isn't it? He'd have to GFI to cancel the ward answer, and it would have basically... Yeah, it's, it's got to be the one dice himself out. Um... He's going to make two GFIs to cancel the ward answer on that guy. Two GFIs. Or oh, one GFI to blitz him. Push him to there, but then to four plus three plus out. Hmm, might be better. And that pushes him to there, and then it's just a four plus three plus out, which isn't even that hard. Yeah, I think this might be easier. <laughs> oh, dear me. Dear me. And this one probably does it, doesn't he? Wow. That was probably about as likely as all the two pluses he made last turn. Wish I hadn't rolled a double skull on that blitz now, eh? 4-4. Four, four. Oh, cunt. <laughs> Yeah, I could have. Yeah, I should have fouled something first. Yeah, you're right. You're right, Amadon. Yeah, you're right. But the thing is, it was a one in four chance to score. There's no point in reducing that chance, is there? At the end, I think it was. I think it was right to go for that. Yeah, the crowd almost returned the ball. If I hadn't made that fucking double score on the first block. <laughs> That would have been that could have been a touchdown. Can't believe that I can't chop the tree down now. 
He was my dream to kill the tree, wasn't he? But he's on eight players, but really he's on one. But then the others, because now I can bolt to score. So now it's now it's a one-one draw, barring barring the fucking cage dive. I could maybe just bolt him and foul him as well at some point. Yeah, I don't know. I think I don't think the foul was worth it then because there was a one in four chance to score, wasn't there? If I'd fouled, brings it down to like twenty percent or whatever. One in four to score would have been pretty good. I don't think I can go for the win though. I really don't think against the Hells. I just don't think I can go for the win. I think I'll still go for the block on the tr on the tree here. Why not? No follows now, and then just go for the block with a tr with a beast. Blitz him and retreat. Yeah, weather change would be nice. Yeah, rock killing his war dancer would also be nice. Even then, just picking the ball up is hard enough with Nurgle, isn't it? No, no, I'll lose because of pitch invasion instead. I'll try that. I'll try that strategy of just losing because of pitch invasion. Seems good. Seems fun, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, one in nine and a fucking pointless block. Oh no, one in eighty-one. On instead of just going to pick up the ball. Oh god. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, oh, the fucking green screen's fucking hours now. I'll just turn it off. What a fucking what a fucking load of shit. Instead of making a block with block. Which would have been a fucking knockdown, and then the other one would have been a fucking knockdown, and then it, then I would have picked up the ball. Instead, I've got nobody here. He's got fucking blocks. It doesn't even matter. Fuck's sake. That's some. That's some. That's some. That's some fucking lose game losing kickoff event. That isn't it. Holy shit! That's a game losing kickoff event. I fucking. I hate. I really hate that games are decided by kickoff events. It's just bollocks. That. That's why I choose the one that cancels. Riot and Pitch Invasion, because they don't cost L's games, do they? But they do cost Bash Team's games. Oh my god, he just gets to knock down my ball carrier. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Man, fucking elves. I like the way there's some bright sparks that say that Nurgle counter elves. Well, they don't, because they're slow as fuck. And you stupid fucking beast go stupid at the wrong, exactly the wrong fucking time. And it's just shit, isn't it? You've got no block, you've got no ball handling. <laughs> I 
I just need to kill him, don't I? We really just need to kill him with this bolt. <laughs> oh yeah, fun, fun. Blood Bowl's really fun. Right. What 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 do I do now? What do I fucking do? This fucking stupid game that I've lost because of a fucking kickoff event. Dodge GFI and pick up the ball for a start, that seems good. Right, good. Double GFI there. Blitz there, or what? I mean, I don't know what the fuck I can do. I... I Double GFI so he can 1 in 36 the, the, the fucking dodge away to score. That's irrelevant, isn't it? Dodge here so he can... Like, what, what can I even do? There's nothing I can do. Right, dodge him away for the assist. And then he's got the... Uh, um, dodge and GFI a couple of times to kill him. <laughs> now that would have been too good, wouldn't it? That would have been too fucking good. Could have fouled him as well if I'd powered him. Right, two nil then, game over. I guess I just give up playing playing Blood Bowl now and just try to get some cars, star player points. Probably lose four nil. Oh man, sound like Looper. Could one in nine the pickup? Nah, of course he fucking can't. Won the GFI. Come on, won the GFI. And look, that was my point. That was my fault by making a two dice block. Without block, because I got fucked by the fucking pitch invasion. But maybe if I'd gone right back for the pickup first instead of making any blocks. I'd have still failed it, but at least I would have had a guy back there. More help, more helpful than um, than Ed the Mad. Thank you, Amador. So shit that the first time, I, the first half, I set up with this the mighty blow guy there in case he made a breakthrough, and this time I didn't. And then he made the breakthrough. I hate strength four fucking war dancers. Holy shit. Right, the claw guy is back. I'm definitely going the noob punching the tree route now. There's nothing. There's nothing left to do. Fucking pitch invasion. That was just a joke, wasn't it? Oh god. Oh well that one that one isn't so bad. If it had gone like that the first time. <laughs> oh, 
god. Where's the that's the dirty there's the um there's the warden says so Yeah that would have been alright wouldn't it? That would have been alright the first time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, VIP, Mr. Yamanda. <laughs> yeah. Farming a stunned player. The worst idea in the game. But of course, when it's a fucking strength 4 war dancer, you gotta do it. This would have been a draw if this had been the pitch invasion. Isn't that stupid? If that had been the first pitch invasion, this game's a draw. I have to try and score quickly, don't I? I just have to. I literally have to. Score on 13 and then turn him over and score again. <laughs> oh dear. No, I mean that 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 pigeon invasion was fine, wasn't it? Fine for me. Like two mine down, three of his, rather than just my entire front line getting fucked. GFIs to score. One, two, th one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Two GFIs to score and one fucking reroll to do it. Holy shit. An <laughs> absolute joke. <sighs> but I mean, I've got to do it for any chance of winning the game, so it's not like it's a decision that I've got to make. If I was 1-0 down and doing it, I wouldn't be happy, but 2-0 down, I have to do it, don't I? are pretty good if they don't roll ones or aren't they? As in, as in completely fucking unbeatable. <laughs> oh, man. Right. Well, this is okay, and it blitz one block the other. First things first, get him seven forward.
God, it's grim. Ah, I've got a block and you don't. I need to get this little fucker down. Got him. Doesn't even die, what a joke. Oh, I could have made that three. Misplay. I guess I've just got to not follow up to get another foul in. Maybe I should have fouled the tree out, eh? Yeah, maybe I should have done. See what the dice are. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Then with um, dirty player, I would have just been a stun because of thick skull, wouldn't it? Yeah, that was there was just the pitch invasion. The pitch invasion killed it, didn't it? The pitch invasion, then a one on the bolt. Nothing, yeah, nothing you can do against that. I don't think, to be honest, I don't think anybody in the world could have. Um... <laughs> if that's going to happen, there's there's pretty much not nothing you can do against it. Is there? I don't think. Like, sure, I could have moved the ball carrier back or whatever position differently, but realistically, that fucking pitch invasion. Combined with a one on the bolt. It was hard times. Seven. I shouldn't have had this last game, I guess. <laughs> Dusty Rhodes, hard times. You got it right. You got it. Oh, I don't mind the tree stand up again. Gives me a chance to knock him down, doesn't it? I'm surprised he's standing him up. Fifty-fifty. <laughs> nah, I don't even care about activating him. Right, just blitz him. Ah, I could make it three dice, couldn't I? Yeah, 
If I was that kind of person, then yes, you're right, this is calcium. Can maybe get a draw, yeah. If I score this turn, I can maybe get the draw, obviously. Obviously, I can't win. Three, four, five, six. I guess I might as well make this two dice with the um with block here. You never know. I could could just get a cast. <laughs> Got to re roll it because I've got to score this turn. Trip wire. No, they, but surely they want calcium, but it's better than just scoring later, isn't it? <laughs> like if I don't score this turn, I've got no chance. Oh my god. So there you go, the wood the war dancer stayed out. You're telling me there's a chance, but with no rerolls it's fucking grim, isn't it? Maybe I should have fouled more. Six players left. They have played solid, yeah, to be fair. I mean I've got I've got nothing against um Dortmund, but oh no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't play a solid turn one where he just let me blast his war dancer. But yeah, losing the reroll is very annoying, but I had to score that turn. Oh yeah, and he did let his plus strength. I mean, that wasn't an easy surf really, was it? I had to activate the beast, which didn't fucking work. Yeah, hover a reroll on the kickoff event, that's not... Yeah, there's a chance. Like, I couldn't do anything except... There was no point not scoring as fast as possible was there when I'm 2-0 down. Like, I had to score as fast as possible. There was no other choice. If I was down 1-0, maybe I would have stalled it out. I'd have maybe gone for the stall out if it was one. If I was 1-0 down. I'd have maybe taken the draw. But um, I had no choice but to go for this, did I? My hand was, my hand was forced... Nice weather for him, that's good. <laughs> oh, for me, because I need to pick up the ball to win, so... Well, to win, to draw. It'll feel it'll feel like a fucking win if I draw this. <laughs> He's got three rerolls and I've got none. <laughs> Banged on. No, I don't think he has either, and not, no. I think he maybe should have done one turn, but he didn't. Yeah. Yeah, it's much easier to play solid when you when you don't fail a roll. <laughs> I'm making a one dice. I guess he hasn't got many players. So it's all right. No, oh, yeah, he did. Yeah, that's right. Silver Hills. Yeah, that's right. He did. That's right. He did. I do remember it now. Yeah, disturbing presence affects hands off. Yeah, it does. It doesn't affect pickups.
Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea, Sheffield Steelix. Yeah, I shall, I shall, I shall do that. I shall do that. It's not a bad idea, that. Right, so what do I want? I want the movement guy back, I guess, and the mighty blow guy forward so he can blitz. Failing you at the most crucial time. Absolutely standard. Oh god, he's based in the fucking... He wasn't meant to be based in the fucking tree, was he? Alright, movement seven guy goes forward then. Fuck it. He was meant to be here. That was pretty, pretty, pretty tragic misplay there. Gave me the choice though, didn't it? Maybe. Guess I might as well foul. Nothing better to do. It's just a block away and then a potato. Such an easy, easy break for him. Maybe a touchdown. I guess that's good actually, giving him a break for a touchdown, because then he might go for it and fail. That was bad though, putting him in the wrong square, wasn't he? He should have been here. Yeah, the fouling has been classed this game, that's true, Pedro Jack. Never spotted until then. He's made the move, excellent. Will he do the handoff when he finds out it's a 5 plus? He will. And then he fails. Good for him. Good for him. Wasn't that good? Some actual. Some actual kind of justice in the game there. Unbelievable. He is in the scoring range already. I will put him there first. Just blitz him with him straight up. Yeah. Got to get the tackles. It's got to get the um, scatter, haven't I? Another scatter. Worth it to three dice it? Guess so. Can't really make it though. So he can go there, 
and he's in range. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He can. Beast can go there. Oh my god, the best Fago. Simply the best Fago. Yeah, there have been, yeah. It was just shit that I had to go dumb with it because I didn't have the rerolls, so I had to make sure I was six squares away, didn't I? So it's just a three and two twos. Crazier things have happened. I don't even want to make three dice blocks. Could have won that. Could have won that on another day, couldn't I? Twenty-five percent to score in the first half. Three-two-two to score there. Four-four in the first half. It came down to. But yeah, on another day I could have won that. The fucking the pitch invasion that fucked us. The one on the wizard. No oh, man. Could easily could have won this. I think I'm definitely gonna sack the beast. I should have sacked him before this. The beast is just the fucking biggest piece of shit there is. The only thing is, at least he gives you three dice mighty blow blocks sometimes, doesn't he? Thank you for the follow. Warring777. Seven, seven, seven.
Yeah, I think just sack the beast. Because having a player you can't rely on sucks. You, you've got to babysit him as well to make it a 2+, plus, and he still just fucking rolls a 1 when it matters. Yeah, I start, I start with the beast because it's it's mighty blow, isn't it? That's the thing. It's just three dice mighty blow blocks. That's all, it, that's all it's good for. Oh, it really sucks not having this light in here, but never mind. I'll have to do. For the end of the video. Just trying to re-roll it, but I didn't win. Spent 70k on my treasury to get a wizard and it failed. Fucking hell. Got quite a lot of arm breaks, but... Only, but then only, only four, well, four cars, but I only did two, though. But he took four and three, four cars from, from 14 AV breaks, so I guess that's kind of all right. <sighs> nah. Agility one block is better than a rookie, isn't he? So, he's getting in. <laughs> I started with the uh, Beast, Four Warriors, Pestigo, two rerolls. It's what I always start with. Well, what I usually start with. Yeah, but it's not high TV, though, is it, young Nathan? It's not high TV. That's the point. If I sack him, I'm. Well, if I keep him, I'm 1460. If I sack him, I'm 1320. Um, yeah. So it's like 1 6 lost 2, which is still good for Nurgle, but it's just. It was just sad that, like, you know, look, if if any of the first few opponents had been competent, they would have won a lot drawn. Like this one, he should have he should have absolutely beaten me. This one, I should have lost. This one, I should have maybe drawn or lost. I did get pretty lucky though in that one. I probably would have beaten somebody good in that game. Um, so I guess it's okay that I lost a game I should have won, but never mind. Um. As soon as I got claw, I got, I got wood elves and didn't break the armor of the tree once. <laughs> right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.